In the early 1990s, the music world witnessed the meteoric rise of Jade, an R&B group that quickly became synonymous with chart-topping hits and groundbreaking music videos. However, beneath the surface of their harmonious melodies and synchronized dance moves lay a tumultuous saga marked by controversy, legal battles, and internal discord. Jade, known for their iconic single, Don't Walk Away, found themselves embroiled in a series of disputes that threatened to overshadow their musical achievements. The group's journey from obscurity to stardom was fraught with challenges, not least of which were the legal entanglements that became as much a part of their legacy as their music. But where is the group today, and how have they been faring? Let's us explore the multifaceted story of Jade, a group whose music continues to resonate, but whose legacy is inextricably linked to the controversies that defined their journey. The early 90s marked the emergence of Jade, an R&B group that would etch its name into the annals of music history with their distinctive sound and dynamic performances. The group's formation was a calculated endeavor, aiming to capture the essence of female empowerment and vocal excellence in the burgeoning R&B scene. Jade was not just a musical project. It was a vision brought to life by the amalgamation of diverse talents, each member bringing her unique flair to the ensemble. Jade's journey began with an ambitious search for members who could embody the group's ethos, strength, versatility, and harmony. The chosen trio, Joy Marshall, Di Reed, and Tanya Kelly, were not just vocalists, but symbols of the group's aspirational identity. Their debut single, I Wanna Love You laid the groundwork for their ascent, showcasing their ability to blend soulful harmonies with contemporary R&B rhythms. However, it was their hit Don't Walk Away that catapulted Jade to stardom. The track, with its infectious beat and relatable lyrics, resonated with a wide audience, securing a spot in the hearts of R&B aficionados and the top charts alike. The success of Don't Walk Away was a testament to Jade's appeal, transcending demographic boundaries and establishing the group as a formidable force in the music industry. The release of their debut album, Jade to the Max, further solidified their status as R&B royalty. The album was a masterclass in vocal harmony and lyrical depth, earning critical acclaim and commercial success. With each track, Jade demonstrated their versatility, navigating themes of love, empowerment, and resilience with ease and authenticity. Yet the rise of Jade was not without its challenges. The music industry, known for its volatility, tested the group's unity and resolve. The pressures of fame, the demands of constant creativity, and the personal sacrifices required to maintain their trajectory were ever-present. Despite these hurdles, Jade's commitment to their art and to each other remained unwavering, a testament to their strength as a collective. As we transition from the euphoric highs of their early success, the narrative takes a darker turn. The seeds of discord, sown by external pressures and internal conflicts, began to germinate, setting the stage for the tumultuous chapters that lay ahead. As Jade's star ascended in the R&B firmament, the group found themselves navigating not just the complexities of fame, but also the treacherous waters of legal disputes that would mark the beginning of a tumultuous period. The harmony that once defined their music was challenged by discord, as controversies began to emerge from the shadows, casting a pall over their achievements. The first whispers of legal trouble echoed with the issue of trademark disputes a common yet complex problem in the entertainment industry. For Jade, the controversy centered around the very essence of their identity, their name. The dispute was not just a legal battle, but a deeply personal one, pitting former allies against each other in a struggle for control and ownership. The name Jade, which once symbolized unity and collective success, became a contentious point embroiled in legalities that threatened to fracture the group's foundation. The crux of the controversy lay in the co-ownership of the Jade trademark. Trademark co-ownership is a rare and often disfavored arrangement due to the potential for disputes, 
and Jade's case was a textbook example of such complications. The legal battle involved members of the group and former members, each claiming rights to the name that had brought them together, but was now driving them apart. The court case, Reed v. Marshall, became a focal point of the controversy, highlighting the challenges of navigating shared ownership in the music industry. The United States District Court for the Southern District of Texas became the arena for this battle, where arguments were made and legal precedents scrutinized. The court's decision to grant summary judgment in favor of the defendants was a pivotal moment, establishing that the members could not be held liable for trademark infringement due to their co-ownership of the name. This ruling, while resolving the legal dispute, underscored the complexities of shared ownership and the potential for conflict it harbors. The legal battles that Jade faced were emblematic of the broader challenges within the music industry, where artistic collaborations often give way to legal confrontations. The trademark dispute was not just about the right to use a name, but about identity, legacy, and the bonds that music can create and, paradoxically, unravel. As the dust settled on the legal front, the scars of the battle remained. The controversy had taken its toll, not just on the group's cohesion, but on their public image. Fans and observers were left to ponder the implications of the dispute, questioning the durability of partnerships in the face of fame and legal challenges. The saga of Jade's legal battles was a cautionary tale, a reminder of the fragility of unity in the high-stakes world of music. As Jade navigated the aftermath of their initial legal entanglements, the group found themselves embroiled in a maelstrom of drama that further tested their unity and resilience. The controversies that emerged were not confined to the courtroom, but spilled over into the personal and professional realms, casting long shadows over their legacy. The internal dynamics of the group, once harmonious, began to show signs of strain as the pressures of fame, creative differences, and the lingering effects of legal disputes took their toll. The once tight-knit fabric of jade began to fray, with rumors of discord and disagreements becoming fodder for the tabloids. These rumors, whether grounded in truth or fabricated, added layers of complexity to the group's narrative, painting a picture of a band at odds with itself. The drama was further amplified by the departure of members, a move that sent shockwaves through the fan base and the music industry at large. Each departure was a blow to the group's cohesion, raising questions about the underlying reasons. Were these exits the result of personal disputes, artistic differences, or the cumulative stress of the legal and public scrutiny they were under? The lack of clear answers only fueled speculation, with fans and critics alike piecing together their narratives from the fragments of information available. The introduction of new members in an attempt to fill the void left by the departures added another layer of controversy. The decision to bring in new talent, while a common practice in the music industry, was not without its challenges. The dynamic of the group was altered, and the chemistry that had defined Jade's early success was difficult to replicate. This transition period was fraught with challenges, as the new lineup struggled to find its footing amidst the lingering shadows of the past. Amidst this turmoil, the group's attempts to move forward were often overshadowed by the drama that seemed to follow them. Each step they took was scrutinized, with the public and the media dissecting their every move. The controversies that enveloped Jade were not just about the music, but touched on themes of loyalty, identity, and the struggle to maintain artistic integrity in the face of adversity. The intensifying drama within Jade served as a stark reminder of the challenges faced by groups in the music industry. The blend of personal and professional pressures, compounded by the public's insatiable appetite for celebrity drama, created a perfect storm. Jade, once celebrated for their musical contributions, found themselves navigating a landscape where controversy threatened to eclipse their artistic achievements. As the group moved towards the next chapter in their saga, the question remained, could they overcome the drama that had come to define them, or would it be the final note in their symphony? 
The crescendo of Jade's internal discord found its legal echo in the trademark suite that would come to define one of the most contentious chapters in their history. This legal battle was not just a dispute over rights. It was a confrontation that laid bar. The complexities of identity, ownership, and the very essence of what Jade represented. At the heart of the controversy was the Jade trademark, a symbol of the group's collective identity and success. The legal skirmish over this name was a manifestation of deeper rifts within the group, pitting member against member in a battle for control. The lawsuit, Reed vs. Marshall, became a focal point, drawing attention not only from the music industry but from legal experts and the public, intrigued by the unfolding drama. The United States District Court for the Southern District of Texas became the stage for this legal drama, where arguments were presented and the fate of the Jade name hung in the balance. The court's decision to grant summary judgment in favor of the defendants was a pivotal moment, underscoring the unique challenges of trademark co-ownership in the music industry. This ruling illuminated the precarious nature of shared ownership, where each party's rights to the collective identity were equal and indivisible, regardless of individual contributions or grievances. The implications of this legal battle extended far beyond the courtroom. The dispute over the Jade trademark was a public spectacle, casting a shadow over the group's legacy and raising questions about the sustainability of collective identities in the music industry. The controversy highlighted the potential for legal entanglements to fracture artistic collaborations, turning bandmates into adversaries and artistic endeavors into legal liabilities. The fallout from the trademark suit was profound. The legal resolution did little to mend the rifts within the group or to quell the public's fascination with the drama. Instead, it served as a cautionary tale about the fragility of group dynamics in the face of legal and financial pressures. The battle for the Jade name was emblematic of the broader struggles faced by artists in the industry, where the lines between collaboration and competition, unity and division, are often blurred. As Jade moved forward, the echoes of the trademark suit lingered, a constant reminder of the challenges they had faced and the controversies that had come to define them. The group's journey, marked by incredible highs and tumultuous lows, was a testament to the complexities of fame, the perils of legal disputes, and the enduring power of music to bring people together, even as it threatens to tear them apart. The narrative of Jade, once a cohesive unit of musical harmony, took a dramatic turn with the departure of key members. These exits were not mere footnotes in the group's history, but pivotal moments that sparked controversy and speculation, altering the course of their journey. Each departure peeled back another layer of the complex dynamics within Jade, revealing a tapestry of personal ambitions, creative differences, and the relentless pressures of the music industry. The first of these departures sent ripples through the fan base and the music community, raising immediate questions about the reasons behind the exit. Was it a clash of egos, a divergence in artistic vision, or the weir and tear of fame that led to this fractory? The absence of clear communication left a vacuum filled by rumors and speculation, with fans and media alike piecing together narratives from snippets of interviews and cryptic social media posts. The impact of these departures on Jade was profound. Each member who left took with them a piece of the group's identity, challenging the remaining members to redefine what Jade stood for. The introduction of new members in an attempt to fill the void was met with mixed reactions. While some fans welcomed the fresh talent, others remained loyal to the original lineup, viewing any change as a dilution of the group's essence. The controversies surrounding these changes were amplified by the solo ventures undertaken by the departing members. These endeavors were scrutinized for hints of the underlying tensions that might have contributed to their exits from Jade. The success or failure of these solo projects was often seen as a referendum on the validity of their reasons for leaving, adding another layer of complexity to the group's ongoing narrative. Amidst this turmoil, the group's attempts to maintain a united front were continually challenged. 
Each departure and subsequent solo venture seemed to underscore the fragility of their bond, painting a picture of a group struggling to hold on to its identity in the face of individual aspirations and external pressures. The controversies that arose from these member departures and solo ventures were a stark reminder of the challenges faced by musical groups. The delicate balance between individual creativity and collective identity, between personal growth and group cohesion, is often tested by the realities of fame and artistic expression. For Jade, these challenges were not just internal obstacles, but public spectacles, played out in the media and in the court of public opinion adding another chapter to their tumultuous story. As Jade navigated this period of transition and controversy, the question loomed large. Could the group reclaim its former glory, or had the departures irrevocably altered the essence of what made them Jade? The saga of Jade, marked by soaring highs and tumultuous lows, took yet another dramatic turn with the group's attempts at reunion. These efforts, aimed at recapturing the magic that once defined their music, were fraught with challenges and controversies that underscored the deep-seated issues lingering beneath the surface. The initial whispers of a reunion sparked a wave of excitement among fans, eager to see the original members of Jade come together once more. However, the path to reconciliation was anything but smooth. The complexities of past disputes, legal battles, and personal differences cast long shadows over the reunion efforts, turning what should have been a celebratory occasion into a contentious affair. The negotiations for the reunion were marred by disagreements and misunderstandings, with each member bringing their own set of expectations and grievances to the table. The delicate task of bridging these divities was complicated by the legacy of the trademark suite and the lingering resentments it had fostered. The very name Jade, once a symbol of unity, became a point of contention, with questions about ownership, rights, and representation muddying the waters of reconciliation. As the reunion efforts progressed, the group faced the daunting task of rekindling their chemistry both on and off the stage. The introduction of new members in previous years had altered the group's dynamic, and finding a balance that honored the past while embracing the present proved challenging. The controversies surrounding these lineup changes resurfaced, with fans and media scrutinizing every move for signs of discord or harmony. The public nature of these reunion attempts added another layer of complexity to the endeavor. Each statement each leaked detail of the negotiations was dissected by the public, fueling speculation and often exacerbating the tensions within the group. The pressure to live up to the legacy of their earlier success, to deliver not just music, but a narrative of redemption and unity, weighed heavily on the members of Jade. Despite these challenges, the group's efforts to reunite were a testament to the enduring power of their music and the bond they shared. The controversies that accompanied these attempts were not just obstacles, but reminders of the passion, the creativity, and the struggles that had defined their journey. As Jade navigated the treacherous waters of reunion, the question remained, could they overcome the controversies of the past to write a new chapter in their story? Or would the shadows of their previous disputes prove it too formidable, turning the dream of a reunion into yet another chapter in the saga of what might have been? As the curtain falls on the tumultuous saga of Jadi, the group's legacy remains a complex tapestry woven with threads of musical brilliance, controversy, and unresolved issues. The journey of Jade, from their meteoric rise to the internal strife and legal battles, culminates in a legacy that is as celebrated as it is contested. The unresolved issues that linger cast a long shadow, raising questions about the nature of fame, friendship, and the price of artistic expression. The legacy of Jade is indelibly marked by their contributions to the R&B genre, with hits like Don't Walk Away, securing their place in music history. However, the controversies that surrounded the group, ranging from the trademark disputes to the internal discord and publicized legal battles, add a layer of complexity to their legacy. 
These controversies serve as a reminder of the challenges faced by artists in the limelight, where personal and professional boundaries often blur, leading to conflicts that can overshadow artistic achievements. The unresolved issues within Jade, particularly the lingering effects of their legal disputes and the acrimonious departures of members, continue to fuel speculation and debate. The question of what could have been had the group managed to overcome their differences and sustain their initial cohesion remains a poignant one. The potential for further collaboration or reconciliation, while tantalizing, is clouded by the past, with each attempt at reunion bringing to the fore the deep-seated issues that have yet to be fully resolved. The impact of these unresolved issues extends beyond the members of Jade to the fans and the music industry at large. The group's story is a cautionary tale about the pitfalls of fame and the importance of clear communication and legal safeguards in collaborative artistic endeavors. It highlights the need for artists to navigate the complexities of the industry with care, ensuring that their creative partnerships are built on solid foundations that can withstand the pressures of success. As fans reflect on the legacy of Jade, they are left with a mix of nostalgia for the music that defined an era and a sense of melancholy for what might have been. The group's journey, with its highs and lows, serves as a mirror to the volatile nature of the music industry, where talent and success are often accompanied by challenges that test the bonds of friendship and collaboration. In the final analysis, the story of Jade is a testament to the enduring power of music to bring people together, even as it poses challenges that can drive them apart. Their legacy, marked by both their musical contributions and the controversies that accompanied their rise, remains a compelling narrative of the complexities of artistic collaboration in the face of fame and adversity. As we reflect on the journey of Jade, their story emerges not just as a chronicle of musical success, but as a narrative rich with controversy, resilience, and the unresolved tensions that continue to define their legacy. The group's voyage through the peaks of fame to the valleys of discord encapsulates the volatile essence of the music industry, where the line between harmony and discord is perilously thin. The controversies that Jade navigated, ranging from legal battles over trademarks to the personal rifts that led to member departures, paint a picture of a group constantly at the crossroads between artistic unity and individual ambition. These disputes, while detrimental in many ways, also serve to highlight the group's significance within the R&B genre, underscoring the passion and intensity that fueled their music and their relationships. The unresolved issues that linger in the wake of Jade's tumultuous journey raise poignant questions about the nature of collaboration and the challenges of maintaining artistic integrity amidst the pressures of fame. The group's attempts at reunion, marked by moments of hope and reconciliation, were often overshadowed by the specters of past conflicts, reminding us that some rifts run too deep to be easily mended. In the end, the story of Jade is a testament to the enduring impact of their music and the complexities of their legacy. The controversies that surrounded them, while often casting a shadow over their achievements, also serve as a testament to their significance in the cultural and musical landscape. The debates and discussions that continue to swirl around their legacy are a tribute to the indelible mark they have left on their fans and the music industry. Jade's legacy, with all its controversies and unresolved issues, remains a vibrant part of the tapestry of R&B history a reminder of the complex dance between fame, creativity, and the human spirit. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.